we are live let me quickly check all right i guess uh, we are live let me just uh okay we are live so if you are here start uh, chatting away in the comment section okay, okay. We are live. So if you're here, start. that is just me uh, with the feedback okay all right all right oh we have some uh, regulars who are already here hello uh, shivam thank you for joining ko rajgor my main man who has been commenting on a regular basis on the channel really i really appreciate you uh, you guys can hear me right i'm just doing a quick audio check can you hear me just give me a thumbs up if you can hear me all right am i audible to you guys is this good enough Hello, uh, Neeraj, Aman. Yes, audible. Perfect. We are good to go. Uh, Sridhar, Sachin, Harry, thank you for joining. Really, I appreciate you guys. More people will be joining. And so before I get on with the first show and let you in on what we are in for in this uh, live, uh, let me quickly address the people who will be watching this uh, repeat playback because they won't be able to join us live. Host, oh, hi, Satish. Hi, welcome to the show. Good to see you guys. Um, and remember, we will be having uh, Ask Me Anything section uh, segment later, so we, you can chat away. I will be uh, looking specifically at the chat box, but now I have to address some things. So if you are watching the playback, we missed you. I wish you were live with us and interacting with me and with others in the comment section. But if you're uh, watching the playback, we missed you. But for the next one, we would really love to have you. And uh, moving on with the show. All right. Okay, I just want to let you guys know that at any time, um, especially during the Ask Me Anything, uh, if you are not comfortable with English, please type away in Hindi, I'm okay with that. Or if you want to type in English, but mention in brackets that you want a response in Hindi, I will try my best, okay? Um, that's fine. If you're outside, don't worry about it. You know, I really appreciate you, you, know, you know, making that effort to join the live. You know, I have uh, so much appreciation for you guys. Okay, so if you want the answer responses, especially during the Ask Me Anything segment in Hindi, please let me know. I will. Um, so this guy, Kayur, all right, he is outside and he's watching the live. So that is the kind of, uh, you know, uh, uh, appreciation I'm looking for for uh, the channel and the community in general so okay so let's get on with the live okay I'm someone who just doesn't uh, you know wing it I have a flow and I don't want to waste your time as well because it is a Saturday okay um, all right Satish Namaskara Guru Heki Dera Chinna Ki Dera all right okay let's move on just give just to give you guys a brief this is how it's going to work okay so this is the first episode of uh, tiktok treasures youtube live first ever this live will be divided into three segments the first one is the main um, thing which is the details of the upcoming giveaway that will happen next week it will start next week and you will have the details announced. The main thing is the prize amount, the voucher for the winner will be announced. And by the way, this live session is not the um, giveaway, okay? This is just a meet and greet and you know, dropping, in some, dropping some info uh, about the upcoming giveaway. Second segment will be Ask Me Anything. You can ask anything about me, the channel, future goals, uh, um, you know, what kind of food I like, all those things, just you know, ask away. And the last part is also important for me because I really appreciate you guys, the subscribers, the community, and uh, um, 
I will be giving a shout out to some of the top commenters based on the number of comments they have left ever since the channel came into existence. Okay, V, this, oh, who's this? Uh, my hairstyle is called uh, undercut, okay? Just shave the sides off and keep the top hair, okay? And it's got a fade, you can't really tell. All right, let's move on. Okay, let me quickly go through some of the comments. Um, I will get to some of these comments later. Perfect dress watch C. It depends on the, uh, you know, uh, the price range. Of, of course, you can pick up a Casio edifice um, or even, a, even a, people wear Casio Duro as a dress watch as well, okay? Uh, it's, it's totally your preference. I even wear digital watches as dress watches. But if you're looking for only analog, there are so many options, you know. It's just uh, totally depends on uh, what your uh, uh, taste is. Okay, all right, so let's move on and talk about the things that we have planned for this live, okay? Namaste, everybody, and welcome to TikTok Treasures. My name is, where is this? Okay, so this is my name, okay? I'm Kirtan Naik, and I started this channel uh, three months ago, and I started posting regularly three months ago, and... Uh, uh, I'm really passionate about you know, what I'll be doing and what I have plans and what I have done so far. I re I'm really passionate about watches and horology in general. You know? um, so I really appreciate you guys for showing the support, the kind of support you've, show, uh, you've been showing me. And we are also on Instagram. I haven't been posting very regularly, but I want to. So please go on Instagram and follow tiktoktreasures.in. Okay, let me get through all these introductory parts. And um, that's it. Are we ready to move on to segment one? Okay. I'm so sorry, guys. Um, okay. I won't be able to attend to the comment section because I want to cover the segment one. So here's how it goes. I will go through the comments later. I will cover the segment one and you get to ask questions based uh, on what I cover in segment one. The segment one is the giveaway details. Now, in a bit, I will be announcing the voucher amount for the winner. But before that, I am doing this live to celebrate us crossing 1,000 subscribers, okay? That is a big achievement for a small channel and I have you guys to thank because I know it's not easy for most people. I've seen people struggling to you know, grow their channel but this wouldn't have been possible without you guys. So for that, I raise a toast. Cheers. This is Fenny, by the way. I, I'm in Goa, so you know, I, I drink occasionally. So this is Fenny, so cheers to you guys. By the way, I talk a lot. So I have to really cut down and just stick to the script. Okay, I, yeah, I do speak Kannada because I'm from Mangalore. I speak Kannada. Kannada was my second language when I was growing up. Okay. Okay, so. All right. Let's, we are on the main feed. You guys can see me, right? Okay, uh, remove the slide and go back to the video, please. We are on the video. All right, the intro bullets, it's covered. Okay, we are coming to the giveaway details. Very important. Now, I don't know if people, the Desert Card team is here. Um, so if they are here, I thank you guys for uh, recognizing this channel, this community and sponsoring this 1000 subscribers giveaway. We really appreciate it as a community. So I will be giving, uh, 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 I will be dropping some information about Desert Card because they are sponsors and I'll do a live demo to show why you, Desert Card is the best option when you don't find watches in your country, especially, you know, most of the viewers are from India. So, okay. I will get to uh, Satish uh, Rao. Nano uh, Bartene, tell me, tell you guys about myself. Uh, let's do that during the AMA section. Let me just quickly do the uh, uh, the first segment, which is Desert Card, because people want to know the voucher amount for the winner. And before I do the AMA, I promise you, I will tell you guys about myself a brief bio. I promise. Just uh, remind me later. Okay, it's just one guy going through all the comments. This is the first time I'm doing a live, so it's not easy, but I appreciate your time, guys, really. Okay, Desert Card. They are our giveaway sponsors, okay? So I have to talk about them a bit. So please, bear with me, a quick word about the sponsor. So what I'm going to do is quickly go to their uh, website and 
Okay, I'll do a quick demo. So I have been ordering from Desert Car. So people have been asking me uh, questions in the comment section of my videos, right? So I have been responding to those uh, questions. So they've been asking questions like, um, how come you have this watch? You're in India and it's not available anywhere. Amazon, Flipkart, Mintra, Ajio, Swiss Time House, Just In Time, Helios, Time Store. No shops have this watch. How come you have it? Because I have been buying these watches on Desert Card. You know, Satish, Satish knows it. He, I, I got him hooked to uh, uh, Desert Card. I sent a Casio bug and it bit Satish and Satish has been buying, <laughs> Satish Rao has been buying all the Casio watches, all right? Um, so I've been ordering watches from Desert Card. So here is a quick demo. So why? Okay. Here we go. All right. So this is their homepage. Okay. I've not logged in through my account and they have this assistant option here, right on the left. I don't, I can't use assistant because I'm not on the iPhone. If you are on iPhone, you can use the assistant to buy from other sites and then direct it to Desert Card and they will do the shipping for you. I use self ship. Now, what is self ship? With self ship, you can buy stuff that is not available on Desert Card or if you have items available on Desert Card, but they are highly priced. And if you find it for cheap or elsewhere, you can buy from there and send it to one of Desert Card's consolidation centers. So when you become a pro member, you become uh, you get these addresses, right? So you get four addresses in four different locations, US, UK, UAE, and India. Now, for example, if you are in India, you don't need the address because you already live here, you have a home address. But say, for example, I give you an example of one of my orders. I couldn't find a watch on Desert Card, but I found it on eBay. But eBay, that seller wouldn't um, send it to India, wouldn't ship it to India. So what I did was I used Desert Card. Right. As a pro member, I get an address in the UK, which is nothing but Desert Cards consolidation address. And, and you get that address against your name with your ID. So on the eBay profile, just add address and mention that address and have the seller send it to the Desert Cards consolidation address, which will arrive in your name. When Desert Card receives the item, say, for example, a watch you ordered on eBay, they will know it is yours because you have the ID mentioned in the address. Right then they will send it to you. Once they receive it, it shows up on the tracking page of Desert Card and you will uh, receive it in a few days. But the duties, customs uh, will, uh, be, will need to be paid because Desert Card, once, they, once it arrives in India, they will let you know you will have to pay it through the Desert Card app or website, okay? That is the brief. So let me quickly show you why I use Desert Card. So yesterday I posted a short about Casio Duro so if you can see, when I was, uh, people commented, how come you're getting it for so cheap? So if you go on Desert Card and look for Casio Duro, okay, let it load. It's taking forever. Okay, so let me click on the first one, right? People were shocked when I posted a screenshot of why it's so cheap. Here you can see, if you click on the US uh, seller, you get it for only 6,000. You know how much it costs in India right now on Amazon with discount, 10,000 something. So if you are a pro member, you don't pay for shipping. And uh, if you uh, uh, use self ship, you get to use uh, the address and uh, that Desert Card provides you so you can shop from anywhere in the world and have it sent to the nearest uh, consolidation uh, 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 center. So if you're a pro member, 6,000 is what you pay. Now, it clearly says here, it includes custom duties and taxes. So people have been asking me, are you sure? What if it suddenly shows up in India and they contact you to pay customs? No, I have been ordering so many watches that you don't have to worry, okay? If it says 6,039 rupees, it is 6,039 rupees. If you're a pro member, you don't even have to pay shipping. But if you are not a pro member and you place an order, it will be 6,039 plus shipping fee, which will come up to like 1,500, 2,000 rupees. So actually you're still paying less than what it costs in India, but you know what I mean, right? But if you are a regular 
Uh, if, you go, if you are going to order watches on a regular basis, I recommend getting a pro membership at Desert Card. So that's it about Desert Card. Are you guys ready for the big reveal? Now we are going to reveal the um, giveaway amount that the winner is going to get. All right. Are you guys ready? I just need to see, <laughs> just need to see uh, quickly go through some comments. I cannot ignore you guys. How many watches do I own? I own about close to 50 watches, mostly Casio. But uh, 2024 is the year I want to, you know, really explore other brands and branch out and bring in some variety in my watch box. Um, what to create, a, how to create a watch under 10K co collection. There are so many options, but the thing is, with Casio, you have the advantage of getting quality for cheaper price, especially during those sales, um, festival sales, etc. You get them for so cheap that you can build a collection of six to 10 watches instead of 10K. That's crazy, okay? All right, so guys, we will arrive at the ask me anything section. I will ensure that I will, uh, uh, no, answer all the questions and attend to every single comment. But now let's quickly disable this. Um, Saturday night, you guys are with me. You know, it means a lot to me. All right, so let's, it's time for the big reveal. Are you guys ready to know what the big reveal is? <coughs> I'm sorry. Are you guys ready to know what the winner is going to get? What desert card? Wait, who is wishing good luck to everyone? This is not the giveaway video. I'm not drawing the winner. The giveaway is only going to start next week. Okay, I'll come to that in a bit. Okay, so the giveaway is going to start next week. Okay, I'll arrive at the details in a bit. But when the giveaway starts, okay, it is going to run for two weeks. At the end of it, the winner is going to get drum roll. Five hundred AED. You know how much that money, how much that is. It's written in the brackets, by the way. Okay, it's it's crazy. <clears throat> Five hundred AED is a lot of money. Someone just commented saying, you know, can I build a, a collection in? Um, and under 10,000, yes. Imagine if you win 500 AED, which is United Arab Emirates uh, uh, Durham's, 500 AED is 136 USD or almost 11,500 rupees. Sorry. That's a lot of money. You can buy a cool uh, G-Shock, you know, or your first very basic automatic watch or uh, you can uh, build a collection of Casio watches, like the basic uh, youth series Casio watches. You can buy a very cool edifice. You can buy a couple of citizen watches, or you can buy, I don't know, Invicta, if that uh, is your fancy. All right, so uh, <laughs> what do you guys think about this voucher amount? Is it, is it, is it good enough for a channel that has just crossed 1,000 subs? By the way, we, we just touched 1,300 subscribers, which is crazy. I didn't expect this to happen. Um, yes, ProTrek is a good uh, uh, buy for this amount, but I'm really excited for the person who is going to win this, okay? By the way, this amount was offered to me. Actually, they offered me a pro membership discount, but I chose not to take it because I'm a pro member. I thought I would rather give it to uh, uh, the winner of the giveaway because you guys have been sh uh, showing me so much appreciation every time I post a video. And, uh, uh, you know, it, it means a lot to me and that's why I, I want to give it away. And this will not be the... F uh, this will not be the only giveaway. I want to do giveaways at every major milestones, okay? I was actually thinking of doing a giveaway at 2000 subscriber mark, but I don't think I'm ready because we are, we are just moving so fast towards that mark. I don't know if I'm ready because, you know, I have my main business. I'll talk to that uh, later, you know, if I have to introduce myself, I'll talk about my life later. I will let you guys in on my life and my uh, life history so far. So uh, you will know how difficult it is for me to run this channel with my own money, right? But I uh, really appreciate you guys. So I hope you like this 
reveal 500 AED, which is almost 11,500 rupees. It's not a small amount. Imagine if we reach 10,000 subscribers, I will do a massive giveaway, which is at five, six times this amount. Okay. Trust me, I can convince people. I can look for sponsors. I can, if I can find a sponsor at this mark, trust me, I can find a bigger sponsor when we reach a 5k subscribers or a 10k subscriber. And you know, it is all for you guys, you know, um, maybe in the future, I want to, you know, split the amount. And so, you know, multiple people can win. So that's the idea. All right. So here is how it is going to work. So again, Desert Card, thank you so much for the appreciation shown, uh, collaborating with us to sponsor uh, the giveaway winner, the upcoming giveaway winner. I have to keep reminding this live is not the giveaway, by the way. Okay. And uh, here is how it will go. Okay. So this, I have ordered this watch on Desert Card. Okay. This is the watch I will be unboxing next week. I think maybe a Wednesday or Thursday, but you'll have to keep your eyes out, eyes open. So as to when this video will go up. Okay. Okay. Let me just quickly fix this. Okay. I will be unboxing that watch. I'll be uploading the video. And once the video is up, you will have to comment. It's the same way as how it happened last time. Uh, when the video was uploaded of an unboxing uh, unboxing of a watch and you had to comment on it and I used a comment picker after a week to choose the winner. I think the winner is here. Santosh is here. All right. So congratulations Santosh. He has received, Santosh is here. He has received the package. I was supposed to upload the picture of him uh, receiving the watch in a confirmation but uh, uh, he is the winner of the first ever giveaway on this channel. So that is historic because when this channel becomes huge, that will always remain that he is the first ever Santosh is Santosh Sivan is the first ever winner on this channel. Okay. So once I upload the uh, video, the, the video of the unboxing of this watch I ordered from desert card next week, the moment I hit upload, you guys will have two weeks to participate all you have to do is comment on it but the details of the format of the comment will be revealed when i upload the video that video will have all the details in the description the terms and conditions the rules and regulations the format for the comment that you should use while commenting on the video to participate in this giveaway uh, will all be revealed in the description of that video that will that will go up on Wednesday or Thursday. So stay tuned for that. Okay, when that video goes up, exactly two weeks is when the giveaway will end. I will draw the uh, winner and I will make it very transparent. I will record my screen just like last time. Keep it very honest and transparent and I'll upload that video on the channel so you guys can see all the, uh, the fairness was maintained and transparency was maintained as well. All right. So, um, so you will have to turn on the notifications on this channel. So if you want to receive updates, uh, especially if you don't want to miss interesting, exciting things that happen on this channel. Okay. Um, that's it. All right. So I will open up the chat for questions regarding the giveaway. Okay. Regarding me, AMA, ask me anything. We will do that later. If you have any questions regarding the giveaway, please ask away. I will uh, wait for about five minutes till I move on to the segment, next segment, which is Q&A. But before I do the Q&A, I will talk about myself a bit. All right. Let me just quickly go, <clears throat> go through the comments. Okay. I'm sorry if I'm missing some of these comments. Um, and also, please don't forget to subscribe if you are new here. Okay, please hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram. All right, let me okay, Santosh is here. Congratulations, Santosh. Good to see you here. I appreciate you guys spending time with me uh, on a Saturday evening. Um, all right. Thank you so much, you guys. Okay, Avinash, if you build a collection, it's on me. I apologize in advance. <laughs> if your bank account will take a hit, apologize in advance. All right. Okay. Sachin wants to buy an Invicta Pro uh, Diver. Great choice. But there is a lot of uh, uh, hate against Invicta. I have a friend, by the way. I don't know if you guys want to see this. Let me know if you want to see this. I have a friend. 
and he's my is very close to lives very close to my uh, house in Goa. He has four boxes, four boxes worth of just Invicta watches, all Invicta, and some of them are customized. And I have held one of these watches. Trust me, it weighs about one kilo. That watch is almost one kilo. That's crazy. And I actually spoke with him, and uh, he said that he would want to come on the channel and you know show some of his favorite Invicta watches. If you would like that, let me know. I will uh, arrange that, and we can have a full show about uh, you know talking Invicta watches. If you're into it. Okay, yeah, so that is that. So the giveaway is a gift voucher. So this is how it is going to work. The giveaway is a, uh, the voucher when whoever wins it will be contacted by Desert Card. And the, once the verification is done by me, they will, uh, they will email you the voucher and you'll have to use the voucher on their website, okay? Uh, they will not send you cash. You'll have to use the voucher on their website to purchase whatever you want. There is no condition as to... Uh, no, you should buy. You should be buying only watches, or you can buy anything under the sun, or that which is available on Desert Card. Okay, whatever is available, just go and buy. If you win, and you have to use the voucher on their website, so that is their um, uh, prize. That is the prize mo money, which is a voucher. Okay, you don't get cash. Navani is traveling to Bangalore right now. Good luck with the traffic in Bangalore. Okay, I've heard. I lived in Bangalore. I lived in. Uh, Austin town, I worked in Richmond town and it takes forever to get from you know, point A to point B, even if point A and point B are only separated by 100 meters. Can you source me Seiko SNX-79 from US? See, you just uh, go to the Desert Cart website, you can look for it yourself, you know, you don't need a middle person. You save a lot of money. Uh, by using Desert Card because you find watches that are not available in, in US has got no uh, so many uh, options uh, watches that which you don't find here you find there even on Amazon Global you can just go to the Amazon US website.com and you find so many watches that which are not available all right so, uh, do you guys have any more questions if you don't have any more questions remember you have we have two more segments the next segment is Q&A ask me anything Okay, and the last section is a shout out to some of the top people in the community on this channel, subscribers who have been commenting on a regular basis and you know giving me feedback as to uh, what they want to see on the channel and how they want to see it, right? Um, and uh, uh, yeah, so I really appreciate you guys. So let's uh, quickly, okay, let's move on before I move on to the uh, ask me anything section. All right, a little bit about me. So it is uh, imperative that you guys know uh, about the person who is running the channel, who is talking to you guys uh, on a regular basis uh, through videos and shots, okay? Uh, so, okay, I'm, I'm getting a bit distracted with the chat. Right, guys, with the watch recommendations and all that, okay, we will cover it in future, uh, this thing. Let's just stick to what is planned for this we are celebrating okay i really i will get to some of you guys <clears throat> later right okay oh just before we move on i have conan's edc easy dad carry conan thank you for being here i know you're in a different time zone in the us um i really appreciate you coming uh, here to say hi and you know uh, appreciating the channel thank you so much i really appreciate you and um if you others watching, please go uh, visit his channel. He does re some really cool stuff with EDC. Um, uh, please go visit his channel, you know, uh, and subscribe. And if you like his stuff, just show some appreciation to Conan's channel as well. All right. And uh, yeah, uh, a bit about me. Okay, so here is my background. So it's 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 important you guys know me. Um, I, my name is Kirtan, I told you. I am from Mangalore, a small town in Karnataka, south of India. Very hot, similar uh, climate to Goa and uh, not as crowded as Bombay, but similar weather, not as uh, polluted. And um, I was born there, I was raised there for the longest time. Uh, I graduated uh, engineering um, 
in Mangalore itself. Okay, so uh, I speak uh, English, I speak Kannada, I speak Hindi, I speak Tulu. Tulu is a local language in Mangalore, uh, the same language which uh, Sunil Shetty, Aishwarya Rai, Shilpa Shetty, Rohit Shetty speak. So I speak the same language, by the way. Okay. Um, and uh, uh, what else? Okay, I did my engineering. I worked for a while. I was in Iraq. I was in Baghdad for uh, uh, one and a half years. I didn't like my job. I was in IT, you know. Uh, all that stuff. Uh, so I, I quit, I came back uh, to India, then I traveled to the UK to do my master's. I chose sports management because I was always into sports, but I learned a lot about you know service quality and marketing and finance, etc. when I was in the UK. And then I came back, I, I, I thought I, I was having the toughest time finding a career and I chose fitness because I was always into sports, right? I used to sprint, I used to play soccer for high school. Uh, and college. I chose uh, fitness. I started from the ground up, did my certifications. I st I'm still a fitness and nutrition coach. So I am a certified fitness and nutrition coach. I've got my nutrition certificate uh, from uh, one of the organizations in Canada. I have clients that I coach every day. So this is not my main, uh, this is my side hustle for now, but I intend to make this channel my main focus okay eventually you know my fitness i will hire a team to run my fitness business so whatever you see on the channel the watches i buy right it's from my own money except for this giveaway voucher is being sponsored but other than that i spend my own money to buying the watches and most people i got this um, um, uh, feedback someone commented on the channel they said that this is unfair i bet with all the amount of watches you're showing on the channel you must be buying it, unboxing it, okay, reviewing it and sending it back as a returns. Sorry, I don't do that, okay. I cannot stoop to that level, okay. It's really unfair on the sellers, okay. I really respect them. Uh, it's really unfair. I don't do that. When I buy watches, I keep it with me. In the future, when I don't like it, I sell it. I know I will lose. But then because I am showcasing it on the channel, I consider it as an investment even in the future when I have to sell it. I lose money on it, it, it doesn't matter because I uh, think of it as an investment because this is a horology channel, watch related channel, so it works for me, all right? Thank you so much for the wishes. Oh yeah, Conan, yeah, I would love to see some Casio stuff on your channel, so yeah, I'm looking forward for it, right? Yeah, Mangalore is a small town because, you know, it takes about one hour to go from one end to the other. And... Uh, yeah, so I am a fitness coach. That's it. That's about me. I'm very passionate about uh, uh, watches. Uh, Cas you see a lot of Casio, but this year I want to branch out. Uh, I have interest in automatic watches. My dad uh, being uh, in the forces, so he, he had an HMT, okay, an automatic HMT watch. I saw that as a kid. I used to wind it as a kid. So, and I don't own an HMT. It's just surprising. But I do intend to buy a few uh, automatic watches this year. Uh, uh, especially Seiko, uh, it's on my mind right now, okay? Um, yes, I enjoy my work. I love coaching my clients. I mean, if you want to check out my, I've been transforming people's lifestyle and health and physique and for the last 10 years with hundreds and hundreds of transformations. Uh, and, and yeah, it is very uh, rewarding, okay? It makes you sleep well at night because thinking that you're changing someone's life and health on a daily basis. But I do make time for this channel, as you guys have seen, you know, I reply to every single comment, right? All right, so let's do the AMA. If you guys have any questions uh, for me, not about watches or recommendations, for ask me anything. I mean, anything means you can ask for recommendations. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, if you want to know more about me, know more about the channel, and main thing, if you see, if you have subscribed, it is because you love seeing the watching the content, but also you want to know, uh, it's only fair that uh, you know what is in store for this channel. So if you have questions about, because, you know, I have already planned in my head as to what I would want to do at every milestone and who I want to reach. I have been sending emails after emails uh, to people for collaboration. So very exciting things, super exciting things are going to happen in the future on this channel, trust me. And uh, if you have questions about the future plans also, please. Okay, uh, 
See, listen, I want to get into micro brands, but I haven't really explored much like uh, San Martin. Someone actually asked me a question about San Martin yesterday, but I will get into those because see, for me, I don't give out information if I don't really know 100% about it. I talk a lot about Casio because trust me, I've been like, uh, I know Casio for the, for the longest time, for years, right? Uh, do I have any rare watch? Well, see, actually, I was looking for a few rare watches. If you want to look for rare watches, uh, one of the places you go for or go to is eBay and uh, you find a lot of rare watches. I don't own them. This one time I actually ordered a Casio Marlin, one of the Marlin watches with the, it's called a Lefty. I don't know if you know about the Marlin series of watches. These were these all stainless steel watches released in the 80, 70s or 80, early 80s, right? And uh, they have the same uh, shape as the you know, uh, A, A158, A168. They were all uh, stainless steel. There was this one particular uh, variant called the Lefty. Lefty is the Marlin logo. The logo of the fish Marlin was on the left side facing down or up. I'm not sure. I wanted to buy that. I bought it, but it didn't get delivered because it got uh, marked as prohibited item because of the battery and all that. So I'm, I'm, I was really, you know, sad. I really wanted to own it. I bid on that on eBay. I didn't get it. I wish I'd owned that. So that would have been a rare watch. Other than that, I don't own any rare watch yet. What is my hairstyle called? I have already answered it. This is called a undercut. Okay. I keep my top. I just uh, go zero from zero it just tapers up to 0.51 all the way to this line so if you go to a barber just ask for a undercut with fade undercut with fade that's the hairstyle okay all right you have one rare swiss watch all right guys so here's what i'm going to do if at any time you want to showcase your watch all right go on instagram okay the so instagram is here go on instagram Follow us, uh, follow us on Instagram and tag me and I will use some of this content with your permission in future videos and also reshare it on Instagram, okay? If you have anything rare, anything exciting to show, showcase to the other members of the community, please share. Do I ride any bike? Yes, I do. I love riding bikes. There was a time when I used to just mount a GoPro on a... Uh, 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 on my chesty and has to ride and make uh, riding videos. I have a 350 classic, by the way. Um, okay, that is really interesting. Conan, so I reckon you are a Indian cuisine fan. Saag Paneer or Palak Paneer, I am a major Palak Paneer fan um, because, you know, it just covers your protein part and a fiber part because, you know, Palak is spinach, so you get fiber and Paneer is protein. So you're uh, two birds with one stone kind of a situation where you get your fiber and you get your protein. So I love, and it tastes better. Uh, for me, I love Palak Paneer. Okay, I have some, uh, okay. When will we get to see all your Casios? Satish, uh, I think I have covered uh, 12 of my Casio watches in one video and I showed all my F91, not to brag, but guys, I have all the F91 variants ever made. It's on the channel, go check it out. And um, I have a few others, so I, I'm going to put them together and make a third video of State of the Collection and I will uh, uh, upload it on the channel. So thank you for letting me know. Um, did I miss any more? Yes, Conan, yeah, you're right. Let's see, I think of it as an investment because if I'm just buying, if, if I was a wealthy man, I'm buying watches just to, you know, uh, satisfy uh, my ego or, you know, um, get those uh, dopamine hit, I, I, I would do that, but I'm not a wealthy man. So when I do buy watches, I see it as an investment to grow the community, to grow the, grow the channel and to impart wisdom and information based on uh, what I know. If I don't know, I don't say anything. If Or if I'm wrong, I ask the community to correct me and I correct, go learn, go back to the drawing room, learn, acquire more information and just become 100% with that. All right? Yeah, love from Kerala. Uh, thank you. Kerala is my neighboring state. So yeah, I used to visit uh, Castle Goat a lot and um, I have visited Bakel Fort quite a few times. I have a lot of pictures on Bakel Fort with my cousins. <clears throat> Um, all right, just browsing through. 
Tushar, congratulations. Thank you so much for the 1K. It's, it's all because of you guys. All right, so I think that's about it. Sujata has a question. When you will buy Rolex? <laughs> I'll tell you what. If you want me to buy a Rolex in the coming weeks or months, please spread the word about the channel. Maybe if I reach 50,000 subscribers, you know, I can maybe <laughs> uh, get someone to sponsor a Rolex on the channel. All right. But one day, one day. But I'm building, I'm going um, up in stages. Okay. Right now, I'm gone. I'm going from Casio to Seiko, uh, Seiko 5 Sports, uh, SRPD uh, 55. Um, and then I will go for Seiko again, but you know, spend about 10, 15,000 more to get their GMT series, um, then go into the dive series, uh, and then eventually get to that one lakh mark, you know, when I have enough money to, you know, get into the Hamiltons and uh, even, uh, you know, eventually uh, uh, go into uh, your Omegas and Rolexes and uh, Grand Seiko. Grand Seiko, one of, I just want to get one Grand Seiko. That is one of my dream watches, right? I mean, imagine watching a second hand go smoothly. That is spring drive technology. That is one of my dream watches to get uh, to buy a Grand Seiko. Okay, maybe in the next two, three years. I don't know. It will happen. All right. All right. Um, what is the most expensive watch you own? Okay, so I have this ready to show you. All right, so this is the one which I have already covered. Can you guys see it? Is it on, is it focused? Come on, focus. Okay, you have, you know this GMD B, B5000, right? I'm gonna take my face out. <laughs> so this is a pain, it's not easy. Okay, if you can see, so this is my GMW B5000. Okay, so this is an all metal G-Shock and this cost me 45, 46,000 rupees after paying the import uh, uh, duties and taxes. And this is my favorite G-Shock, okay? This is the uh, GW5000U. I have to make a review video for this. Uh, why is it not going? I have to cover my face. Okay, it's in focus. So this is the uh, GW5000U. It's got a, a, a case pack that is metal. Yeah, I absolutely love this watch, okay? So um, GW5000U is my <clears throat> second expensive watch. So this including customs uh, duties and taxes cost me 30,000 rupees. So these are my two prized possessions, GMW B5000 and the GW5000U. All right. Thank you, Conan. I really appreciate it. So I thought, you know, if I'm going live, I'll do it the right way and be all professional and stuff with, you know, a lot of information to share. All right. So when you will get a Casio AE1200 giveaway, like guys, listen, I'll tell you what, when we reach 2000 subscriber mark, I will plan to do a giveaway, but this time I just don't want to make one person happy. I'll probably, you know, uh, give three watches away. So that's a good suggestion. AE1200 is a very popular watch, Casio Royale. Uh, it's got a cult following. It's got a separate subreddit on uh, Reddit, uh, AE1200 called Casio Royale. So you guys should check it out. It's all about AE1200. All right, guys. So, um, What you want do YouTube content in the first place? Okay, YouTube content. So here's the history of this channel. Okay, when I uh, I got I bought an AE1200 WHD, which was a all metal. Uh, I mean, a resin case with a, a metal bracelet, which I sold eventually. I was I wanted to uh, resize the bracelet, so I thought I'm resizing it. I may as well start a YouTube channel. Spur of the moment, right? I set up the camera, I started recording the whole thing, okay, it was a one hour video because I struggled and I resized the bracelet using tools available at home, no screws, no screwdrivers, no pins, no pin pushers, nothing. And I upload, I edited out the um, 
unimportant bits. I uploaded that and I got a few views, like three or four views. But then it really kicked off when I bought this watch, okay? This GMW B5000 is what got started everything. I unboxed it and this video now st stands at 13,000 views. And I thought like, let me make it a you know, thing. You know, I start this channel and talk about Casio watches because when I started the channel, I already had so many watches in my collection. So I had, you know, watches to make content. So I thought may as well do it. And that's how it got started. And you guys have been the life force, you know, helping me uh, build this community and this channel. So it's growing because mainly because of you guys. All right, guys. So, okay. A quick heads up, if I missed any question. Okay, we have Watch Gyan. Hindi, by the way. Uh, okay, we have Watch Gyan Hindi, he's a channel. He's got 50,000 50, subscribers and he makes uh, videos on uh, um, watches in Hindi so you should go check out uh, watch can Hindi and he really supports this channel and there was a time I didn't even ask he uh, po uh, no, uh, he uh, mentioned one of my video links in his comment section and he let me know and I really appreciate it you know that just tells me that you know our community is appreciated and uh, um, means a lot to me All right Okay, and he's wishing Yugadi Habbada Shubhashaya Galu to everyone. It's the festival time, Yugadi, as we call it in Karnataka, and it's called uh, with different names in different parts of the country. But uh, yes, Yugadi, happy Yugadi, everyone. And if you're from Karnataka, Yugadi Habbada Shubhashaya Galu. I am currently in Goa. All right, guys, so um, we are 50 minutes into the live session. <clears throat> what is my opinion about Pro Trek 340? I personally haven't looked into it, so I cannot give you any information. But Pro Trek is some of the sturdiest and well-built watches of Casio, alongside uh, you know uh, all the rugged uh, uh, the Mudman series and the the uh, what do you call uh, all the all-metal series of all the squares. Right? Uh, not sorry, not all metal. The thing with all metal watches is that, you know, they have a separate uh, se section inside between the module and the, the case, uh, a resin to, you know, uh, absorb the shock. So I'm talking about all resin and well-built ones with the, uh, uh, the Mudman series, the Protrek series. They are, but I, in particular 340, I will look into it, you know, I will, uh, look at the specifications but then see with me for me to give my first hand experience i need to own the watch so that is the thing with uh, a channel that has just started three months old i can only talk in detail about watches i own about 50 of those if i have seen any watches online i cannot really comment on um uh, a few things i can comment on the size and specifications and you know the battery life and their ability to um absorb shock and all those stuff but you know my personal experience i have to keep it out of it because i haven't experienced those watches personally in the future maybe when we get collaborations and you know i get sent watches for review of course you will get my first hand uh, a review right oh yeah carbon core is one of the uh, best options to go for uh, but um, um, it's still I would still go for a uh, stainless steel core because you know you get uh, stainless steel lugs and you don't have to worry about broken lugs. All right, so guys, so uh, we have come to the second segment, uh, end of the second segment, which was the ask me anything. Okay, I'm so sorry if I missed some of your questions. Um, I own a, <clears throat> a classic 350. I have owned it for three years now. I have covered. 28,000 kilometers that just shows you how much I love to ride. I have done a lot of long trips between Bombay and Goa, between Goa and my hometown Mangalore multiple times to and fro. I love riding and some of my best ideas, whether it's my fitness job or with this, happen when I'm riding because it's just like you and the highway and you get to think uh, a lot of things, you know. It's, uh, yeah, it's exciting. 
All right. Bad Boy Gaming. What's the time now? It's uh, 8.50 as told by my GM, uh, GW5000U. All right, guys. So I have to uh, end this segment here. But now we come to the most exciting bit. I mean, actually, it's equally exciting. The shout out to some of the top commenters. Are you guys ready? Now, if you see your name on the slide, please, if you're live, if you're watching this, please say hey. And uh, are you guys ready? So these are the top commenters. You know, I really appreciate these people because uh, from time to time I will do shout outs. And uh, if I see that you guys comment a lot and you know, you've been uh, uh, you know, showing appreciation for the channel and helping it grow, helping, the, helping to grow the community. Speaking of community, by the way, I will work, ask suggestions from some of you whether to start a separate group whether it's Reddit or Facebook group, so people can interact with each other. See, YouTube, uh, the community tab, the section is, is limited uh, in terms of features, right? So uh, it doesn't become very interactive. And I am thinking about it, but uh, I will keep you guys apprised or, or notified on that, okay? Now, the last part, the third segment, very important, exciting. Some of you guys who've been commenting in the live comment section, you guys are in this list, on this list. All right, are you guys ready for the last segment? If you are on the list, say hey in the comment section, okay? Here you go. All right, you, I mean, every single subscriber matters. From the first subscriber, sorry, that uh, subscribed to the channel. That has got lime and chili. From, from the first subscriber, Till the latest subscriber, we, we just crossed 1300. Everyone means a lot. But if you are taking time out of your busy schedule and you know, doing all these multiple things, and if you are commenting you know, and interacting with me in the comments, because see, when you interact, what happens is, it just lets the algorithm know that this channel needs to be boosted. And when we grow, we build our community. And my goal is to build a community that is, uh, that has zero toxicity, right? We just lift each other up. And um, even, uh, even I get uh, uh, comments uh, which are very bullying and uh, which are very toxic and negative. I don't delete them. I just keep them. I just choose to ignore because my energy can be spent on focusing on people who are actually showing genuine appreciation. I do welcome constructive feedback, by the way, because that will only help us grow the channel because see, I've had some constructive criticism of the channel regarding the light, um, regarding the audio, etc. And I have taken it on my stride and I have worked on it and that is why people appreciate it. And that is, uh, that works for me, you know, but if you're being very toxic and uh, you will just be ignored, I, I will never delete the comment, okay? Um, so first up, Satish Rao, 93 comments as of yesterday. I, I prepared the slide yesterday. And by the way, I did it manually. So if I missed your name, and if you have, you know you've been commenting a lot, if I missed your name, apologies, okay? So please, please forgive me and let me know if I missed your name. Uh, Satish Rao, I really appreciate you. You know, I can't tell you how much I appreciate you. And uh, uh, your the interactions I have, sometimes you mention some watches which I have not even come across being a Casio fan, then I have to go Google and find out, oh, this watch exists. So it not everyone knows everything, okay? Even Teddy Baldasser or uh, Nico Leonard, right? These are some of the top uh, creators in the horology field on YouTube and even they learn on a daily basis and they talk about it, you know. Um, not everyone is a complete expert that they know everything. They know the whole history, the whole mechanics and the whole technology. Everyone is uh, learning and even I am learning. So as we go along, like the knowledge only grows, right? Kayur, Kayur Rajgore, if you're here, I know you are outside, you're watching the live outside. I'm making a special mention because you are in the number two position. I appreciate you because you know why? Every time I post a video, I spend about 30 minutes staying online because just to check, you know, who is coming uh, on the comment section. You have been the first one to comment on the video every time I've uploaded a long form video, right? I appreciate you so much. Karthik Goel 752, Sujit Kot, eBob4177 uh, has given a few recommendations uh, before. I really appreciate you. Sai Kiran, 
uh, Shri, Shrikant Shetty, Robo52 also uh, has given a few recommendations and you know uh, suggestions and uh, corrected me on a couple of things. Appreciate it. Basic WR, Suresh Oban and uh, Suresh Oban was one of the first subscribers uh, when this channel started and Duke Mayhem. There are a few others with, you know, 11, 10, 8 comments. You know, you are all there. You know who you are. I really appreciate every one of you. And uh, number seven is V. Yeah, Shri V. Uh, yes, you're number seven. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, Sawik Mohanta, best watch strap. I mean, how can you see? Um, you cannot talk about strap on its own because... Um, it has to match and blend really well with the case, right? Like for example, if you consider Casio, right? There are certain models uh, which don't go well with a Milanese bracelet, but the A700, because it is so thin, it just works with it. You know, Milanese bracelet is also very thin and not a lot going on because it is mesh. Goes, so it totally depends on the watch. Um, and I'm a fan of metal bracelets, okay? Then come... Uh, your durable ones which are your uh, you know resin when, when i say durable i mean they don't last too long like a stainless steel but then you don't have to worry about scratches and stuff with the resin or polyurethane bracelets and uh, you can use them in a rough manner and not have to worry about scratches but resin will eventually break okay so you have to know that with a lot of sweat and uh, dirt and all that with sun exposure with uv resin will eventually snap it will break but Stainless steel, best bracelet, and again, it depends on whether it's an oyster bracelet, uh, or, or whether it's a Milanese bracelet, or whether it's three road bracelet. It, it depends, totally depends on the construction of the case of the watch. It has to match, okay? You can't match anything with anything. Uh, it doesn't work that way. All right. Pre me owns a classic 352, uh, so great. All right, guys, so I think we have come to the end of the live. Arun is a new subscriber. Thank you, Arun, and thank you for visiting the channel and subscribing. All right, so I'll just uh, come back to the main feed, right? Uh, please, subscribe, okay? We, uh, we covered uh, the giveaway. This video was not the giveaway. I have to let you guys know, and any video that, uh, any giveaway that we do, have done or we will do in the future will uh, i have to actually tell this out loud that youtube has no association with our giveaways youtube or their affiliates have no association with our giveaways it's purely done by me the channel and in the future when the community tags along and um, also when we get sponsors so it's totally on us and it is not uh, it's got nothing to do with youtube we're just using their platform okay um, I have to uh, make that disclaimer very clear. So please subscribe. And every one of you, Conan, thank you. Uh, thank you so much. Okay, I'm looking forward to seeing some um, Casio related content on your channel as well. Right. And all the new subscribers, if you've been here. And uh, again, if you if you're watching the playback of this video, I appreciate you, for, you know, staying on till the end. You know, it means a lot to me. And I just realized I didn't speak in Hindi. No one asked for me to speak in Hindi. I didn't speak in Hindi. <clears throat> so I guess you don't get to hear me speak in Hindi. You'll have to wait for the next live. I will give you one minute. If anyone wants me to speak in Hindi, ask me a question. I will respond in Hindi. And then we'll wrap it up. Okay, I'm just waiting. No question. I'll wait for 30 more seconds. If you want me to say in Hindi, you'll have to ask for it in Hindi or ask me to respond in Hindi. All right. All right. 30 say F name. What is the wait? What is 30 say F91 review in Hindi? Okay, 30 second F91 review in <laughs> that's quite a challenge. Okay, let me do I have my F91 around here? Let me okay here. Okay, so I have my F91 here. Okay, let's quickly go in Hindi. Okay, it's a request. I respond to request. Okay. 
ये जो F91 है ए लेजेंडरी वॉच है जो कैसियो सालों से मैन्युफैक्चर करता आया है हर साल तीन मिलियन से चार मिलियन पीसेस मैन्युफैक्चर करता है और आ, ये है एक लेजेंडरी वॉच है अगर आपका मूड करता है कि आज कुछ सिंपल पहनना है तो ये परफेक्ट वॉच है और इसका फंक्शन वेरी बेसिक है सबसे बेसिक जिसका टाइम एक टाइम कीपिंग मोड है अलार्म मोड है स्टॉप वॉच है क्रोनोग्राफ मोड और आ, बस उतना ही है इसका जो लाइट है एक कोने में पड़ा हुआ है एक ग्रीन कलर का लाइट जो इसका डिस्प्ले को बिल्कुल भी लाइट अप नहीं करता है सॉरी आई एम यूजिंग सम वर्ड्स इन इंग्लिश लाइट अप नहीं करता है लेकिन ये बिकता क्यों है क्योंकि इसका हिस्ट्री है जो ये नाइनटीन एक्चुअली एग्जैक्ट ईयर मालूम नहीं है मेरे को लेकिन नाइनटीन एटी सिक्स में फर्स्ट टाइम रिलीज़ हुआ था लेकिन तब से ये हर साल पॉपुलर रहता है मैंने देखा है कि जिनके पास रोलेक्स है ना उन लोगों के पास भी एक एफ नाइन्टी वन रहता है ज़्यादातर बिकॉज इट इज़ अ लेजेंडरी वॉच राइट सो दैट्स इट दैट्स माई रिव्यू इन हिंदी ऑफ एफ नाइन्टी वन आई एम सॉरी इट वेंट बियॉन्ड थर्टी सेकेंड्स कॉनन बट थैंक यू फॉर आस्किंग दैट राइट वॉट यू वर्क Okay, I'm sorry, Sujata. I know you asked a lot. I am a fitness and nutrition coach. I have been practicing fitness and nutrition for the past ten years. It is my core business. So all the watches you see on my channel, they are my own watches which I have bought using my own money, which I uh, set aside every month from my main fitness and nutrition coaching business. And I buy and uh, look at it as an investment. And uh, <laughs> I'm sure you enjoyed that Hindi. I don't know if you understood it, Conan, but. Uh, All right, Anand has loved your Hindi. Anand is another one of those uh, 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 regular subscribers. Okay, I'm going to sh <laughs> show some of the comments on the window quickly, right? Um, okay, see this GD three fifty one BR. Okay, that is a legendary watch. I absolutely wait. Uh, this watch is built like a tank. If you bought this watch, it's like You have you have to keep this watch for life. You know, it's like you can throw it off um, Empire State Building and it still won't break. Um, that's great. Goodbye. Goodbye. Really. And I just did this review in Hindi. Conan is in the U.S. He's got his own channel, so go uh, follow him. By the way, subscribe. I he requested for me to review the F ninety one in Hindi. I just did. All right. So that's it. <laughs> you know what that's the reason i spoke a bit of it in english uh, so you could understand all right so um some of my top guys uh you know this guy this sir satesh rao on top of the list you know why he's on top of the list today that is the number of comments he's left on the channel in the last 3 months and i really appreciate you satesh uh ತುಂಬ ತುಂಬ ಧನ್ಯವಾದಗಳು ನಿಮಗೆ ಓಕೆ ಎಲ್ಲ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಆಶೀರ್ವಾದ ಹೀಗೆ ಸಪೋರ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇರಿ ನಮ್ಮ ಚಾನಲ್ ಗ್ರೋ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಕಮ್ಯುನಿಟಿ ಗ್ರೋ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ದೊಡ್ಡ ದೊಡ್ಡ ಸ್ಪಾನ್ಸರ್ಸ್ ಸಿಗ್ತಾರೆ ಫ್ಯೂಚರಲ್ಲಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಹೌ ಮ್ಯಾಂಗ್ಲೂರಿನ್ ಸ್ಪೀಕ್ ಕನ್ನಡ ಬಾದ್ ವೈ ಆ ರೈಟ್ ಆ ರೈಟ್ ಗೈಸ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು ಸೋ ಮಚ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಅಪ್ರಿಸಿಯೇಷನ್ ರಾನ್ ಇನ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು ಫಾರ್ ಅನ್ ಅಪ್ರಿಸಿಯೇಟಿಂಗ್ ಯ ಲವ್ ದ ರಿವ್ಯೂಸ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಟ್ರೈಂಗ್ ಮೈ ಬೆಸ್ಟ್ ಯು ನೋ to bring in as good a production quality on my view uh, reviews uh, i'm sure you guys are enjoying that um, yes it has been a lovely session uh, it's because of you guys Th thank you for participating um why are seiko watches cost costly it's because of the movement you know it's it's not quartz it's automatic and uh, there's a lot of work that go it cannot be i mean it is still mass produced in the seiko uh, factories in japan but it's it's more complicated you know the thing with mechanical watches is you know um, there's a lot of work than precision that goes into it uh that is why automatic watches are costly and digital watches are cheap the when the whole quartz movement started in the early 70s it the the mechanical watch uh market took a big hit because when it comes to accuracy you cannot beat quartz you know quartz is like the epitome of uh accuracy and that is why um people buy mechanical for the craft 
not a fan of the Hello Kitty G-Shock collab and even the Ed Sheeran uh, collab, I don't know, not a fan. I don't, I, it doesn't appeal to me, but if it's your fancy, then why not? Um, all right, guys, I'm so sorry if I, I'm not able to respond to some of the chat because we started at eight o'clock sharp and we are at 9.10. Okay, that's one hour, 10 minutes. In conclusion, okay, so this is uh, what we covered today. Uh, we covered the giveaway uh, details that is going to happen. So stay tuned in uh, on Wednesday or Thursday, the video, uh, the video will go up. And before I post the video, I will let you in on the details as to when it will go up and how long, the how long the giveaway will run and how the winner will be chosen. Keep an eye out. The video will be an unboxing video. It's basically the next video. Wait. Yeah. The next video that goes up on the channel will be the video that you guys need to comment on, right? And you will uh, be told as to how you need to be commenting so that everything will be mentioned in the video. And good luck to everyone, okay? Once the video goes up, you have two weeks to participate. And uh, uh, I'm really excited, you know, whoever is going to win this, they are going to win. Uh, the voucher of uh, 500 AED, which is the equivalent of 139, 136 USD or 11,300 Indian rupees, okay? So good luck to everyone. Saturday night, you guys have been with me chatting away. Uh, oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Conan, yes, uh, WS1700H. In fact, uh, I actually scripted a short video on WS1700H. Um, to make a short about it, because I don't have, I mean, no one has a watch yet except for people in Japan because it was released in Japan and sold out. Okay, I, I, it, it is a good looking watch from the WS series. I cannot wait for the watch to release in India. Um, I'm actually, if it releases, I want to buy the WS 1700H. Um, I don't know if it's ugly though, but it is, uh, um, it looks very uh, sturdy for its price. It's from the youth series, WS series. But yeah, when it releases, I want to uh, get it. I am actually making a shorts uh, video on it uh, tomorrow. Uh, I will be uploading the shorts about my take on it. And you know, it, it, it got sold out within days apparently in, the, in Japan. So I can't wait for it to be uh, sent to other countries and even India. And I can't wait to pick it up. Even if it doesn't arrive in India, on time, like the sellers don't bring it, I will probably order from uh, Desert Cart, you know, if it shows up, because I'm sure uh, some of the US sellers will uh, make it available for sale and Desert Cart will pick it up. All right, guys, so thank you so much for being part of this show, episode one of TikTok Treasures uh, show. And um, I will come up, uh, come up with something exciting for the episode two. I will keep you updated as to when that will happen. I hope to see most of you guys again. I know some of you guys by name now. So yeah, and I have a list of people uh, who um, uh, have uh, participated today and who are regular commenters. So thank you so much. And uh, okay, let me just quickly close this. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for helping me build, in, build, uh, build this community and thanking, thank you for helping me grow this channel. It's because of your support that we have reached a point where we've crossed 1000 subscribers. We got a sponsorship and uh, keep, keep supporting me. And it's Saturday night. Just, just end this live, you know, just, just stop talking to me. Just leave the chat section and go have fun, go party or go out with your family, go have dinner. And I need to go order my dinner now. And uh, thank you so much for being a part of this live show. And uh, stay tuned for that unboxing video, which will be the video you need to comment on to participate in the giveaway. And uh, it is an act ex uh, interesting watch, by the way. And um, uh, I I'm sure you're looking forward for it. And uh, thank you. Have a good night. All right. Good night, uh, Shubratri. Uh, Shubratri in Canada as well. All right. Thank you, everyone. Uh, bon nuit in France, uh, French. That's it. That's, those are the languages I know. All right. Thank you so much, guys. So have a good night. I'm going to stop streaming now and uh, dream about watches tonight. All right. Dream about Casio especially. All right. Cheers. <clears throat>